What's up, YouTube? And welcome back to another lounge fly bag. So I have done my Star Wars one. I've done my Steamboat Willie one. I believe I've done this. I hope I did. I'm going to have to go check after I make this video. Um, Space Mountain, which was number one of the Mickey Fan attraction. So go and check all those out. I definitely show them to you. And I was showing you as a guy that actually models them. So you, you, know, you want to see me model these bags. So, Space Mountain was January. I originally skipped on bag number two and then got lucky. So, I actually ordered bag number three before I ordered bag number two. And bag number two was sold out when I ordered bag number three. But, magically, I don't know how this happened, but magically I got an email from Shop Disney saying, Hey, you have great taste. Check out this item that you have on your watch list. Blah, 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 blah. And the bag was available for purchase. And if you don't know what bag I'm talking about, I am talking about the Pirates of the Caribbean. Main, Mickey's main attraction. February, month two. Last five. So as you can see, this bag I was questioning. So when I first saw this bag on Shop Disney, I went, I don't, I don't know. It's a black and gold bag, but I don't really know how this thing's going to look. And this was fine, but the ears kind of threw me off. And then, after I got it, the ears make a whole lot more sense. And there's some color fading, but it is what it is. It's probably why it became available, because there's some color fading on the ears right there and right there. But I really don't care. This is for our own personal collection. The ears are skulls in the design. So that's pretty cool. See on the side, nothing. Your normal zippers, quality zippers on this side, a compass, and on the back, I just said Pirates of the Caribbean. Okay, I'll see what this thing looks like inside. So I'm pretty sure that this thing may have been returned because somebody saw color fading on the ears, like both ears have a little bit of color fading, but I don't care. It's now in our collection and I'm happy with it. The wife's happy with it. Let's see what the inside looks like. And the inside. Oh, yeah. I got to take all the, I gotta take paper out. You're going to have to see this inside. It's nothing over the top. And I don't know if you'll be able to see it with the camera. But it's like, it's kind of hard to see. There is pretty much the a similar flowers and shrubbery. And I don't know if you'll be able to see this. You might. Let me see. Hold on. We'll get a little flashlight thing going on here. Flashlight. Oh, that's nice my phone. I should decide to agree with me. So you guys might be able to see the design on the inside. So that's the design on the inside. So that's pretty cool. So yeah, nice little design inside. Zippers are always lovely with cloud fly bags. I always like love the zipper action of cloud fly. Let's put the paper back in. His wife's going to want to keep it in shape. I don't know if she's never going to use it, but it doesn't really matter. It's just going to be stuck full. And I'm going to actually have to get this thing zipped up. I'm actually going to model it for you guys because that's what I do. I don't know if my wife knows that I'm modeling these, these lounge fly bags. Um, but yeah, so all nice and stuff. Getting ready to hang back on the wall. So nice padding. Uh, so I'll be back. I'm going to get this thing set up and I'm going to model it for you guys. Be right back. And I'm back. And I'm wearing the bag. So, like every other lounge fly bag I've ever done, if I can model it for you guys, I, I model it. So, there you go. This is what it looks like. This is me wearing it. It sits nice on the back. It's a good 6 foot 3, 6 foot 4 guy wearing these bags. I know most of you probably think these are absolutely ridiculous for a guy to wear, but I actually really like this bag. I would wear this bag. I like black in general, so this is a good bag for me to wear. I don't know if my wife would ever let me wear this to <laughs> Disney Park because she would tell you it's a collectible. So, what do you guys think? Would you wear something like this? Would you buy something like this? There's 12 months of these, and I have four of them. So until next, guy, next time, guys, take it easy. Have a good one. Peace.